Hello, this is Daniel Plays. My name is Daniel and welcome to yet another Minecraft video in which I'm going to show you how to install Optifine for Minecraft 1.17. That's right, in this video, I'm gonna show you how to install Optifine for 1.17. Now, the one that I'm gonna be showing you how to install doesn't even support shaders yet. I just wanted to get that out of the way. I just wanted to let you know, this video was recorded only moments after the first Optifine release was released, after the 1.17 release had actually just been released. So I just wanna let you know, there's no support for shaders yet. This is just to, you know, give you all the information there is about Optifine. There's no shader support yet, but you can use it as an FPS booster and a performance booster anyway. So I'm gonna show you you how to install it and once it does get shader support for 1.17 of course I'll bring you a full tutorial and let you know that this one is no longer the most relevant one but you should actually go check out the one with the shaders. Before we get into it if you like this video be sure to give it a thumbs up if you want to see more of these kinds of videos pop up on your homepage click that big red subscribe button and last but not least if you need a good and reliable Minecraft server host be sure to use my affiliate link down below in the description so you actually support my channel as well. So first things first what you want to do is open up your Minecraft launcher wait for it to load and then select latest release if you have a ton of profiles and you can't find it over here go over to installations type in latest in the search bar and you should see latest release and maybe even latest snapshot just use the latest release and click play. This will actually make sure you will have 1.17 installed on your computer. So here we are in 1.17. All we got to do now is actually click quit game. Now from here on, you can either use the links down below in the description or just look everything up yourself. But I think you're going to want to actually use the ones in the description because that's way easier. So the first thing we're going to do is actually download Optifine from Optifine.net. Once you're on this page, go over to downloads. And here it says 1.17. That's the one we need. Now we only have a preview version as of recording this video. So you have to click preview versions right here to actually make it appear. Then what you're gonna wanna do is click download. Now in the future, this is gonna be a full release. So you don't have to worry about this anymore. Just click download right here. This will redirect you to an ad page where you have to wait five seconds for a skip button to appear right there. You just click that and you'll be redirected to a download page. Now a little trick to actually avoid more ads is to open up a new tab, come back to this one, click download, and as soon as it starts downloading, you close that tab, because if you don't, it's just gonna redirect you to more ads. As you can see, we just downloaded Optifine, and because it's a .jar file, we have to click keep, because Chrome is cautious with .jar files. Now, if you press Control J on your keyboard, if you're on Chrome at least, you will be taken to your downloads, where you can then see the file much better and you can actually see if it has this Java icon or not. If this is not what you see, we're gonna have to fix a few things here and there. The first thing you should try is click show in folder, right click the Optifine file and select open with, and then try to actually find Java platform as the binary. If it's there, just click it and it will open the installer just fine. Now, if that doesn't work, that probably means there's either something wrong with the .jar file extension or you don't have Java on your PC. And to find out which one of the two it is, you're gonna wanna actually use the first link down below in the description to where it says fixing Java. The first one is called a jar fix. And what this program will actually do is fix your .jar file extensions or tell you you need to install Java. Once on this page, click jarfix.exe right here it will download a small program. You click it, you'll get a UAC prompt where you have to click yes or no. You just click yes, and then it will tell you either the .jar suffix has been registered successfully, which is a good sign, which means you did have Java, but it wasn't associated with .jar files. Or if it says you need to download and install Java, don't use the link in here because it won't work. Just click okay and use the second link down below to actually download Java from the official installation page. The page should look like this and you just click this big red button right here to download and install Java, wait for it to finish and then come back to your download, click show in folder and it should now already have this icon. If it doesn't, at least I'm sure it will appear over here now when you select open with. Now you can either click Java right here or just double click the file now that everything has been fixed and you should see an Optifine installer for 1.17. All you gotta do now is click install. This will take a few seconds and then it will say Optifine is successfully installed. Just click okay, close this, close your browser, and this is where you wanna actually download your shaders. But like I said, I'm gonna make an updated tutorial when shaders actually are supported in Optifine 1.17. For now, I'm just gonna show you 
how to actually launch Minecraft correctly to actually use Optifine and gain that performance boost that you normally get with Optifine. So once you launch Minecraft, you should see the Optifine profile right here selected for you. If it didn't select it for you automatically, you go over to installations and you should find Optifine here or you want to just type in Optifine in the search bar. And as you can see, there it is. All you got to do now is actually click play. Here we are. We're in Minecraft 1.17. It says modded because Optifine is technically just a mod. To check whether you have Optifine, go into options, video settings, and it should say Optifine something something and Minecraft 1.17 in the bottom right corner. So like I've said a million times now, shaders do not work yet in this version, but will work in future versions. So I'll update this tutorial once they do become available to actually show you the full installation process, including adding shaders. So that's pretty much how to install Optifine for Minecraft 1.17. I always like to include a little segment about Java and how to fix issues regarding Java because I've seen so many questions on so many of my videos about simply just how to fix Java errors or how to fix a file not opening with Java. So that's been it for this video. I hope this video actually did teach you how to install Optifine. There's quite a few things that can go wrong as you saw and I hope I explained as well as I could how to actually avoid these problems or when you do run into these problems how you can actually solve them. Once again if you enjoyed this video and it was actually helpful to you then be sure to let me know down below in the comments and hit that thumbs up of course. Of course if you want to see more of these types of videos pop up on your homepage regularly be sure to hit that subscribe button. And then, as always, I will, of course, catch you in the next one. See ya!